This is our top secret laboratory. And Connor is working on solid edge with synchronous technology. So, he's going to modify this shape. Now, what did you want to do? Cut it. You want to cut it? Or what do you want to cut? You want to make what? What do you want to do? I want to cut this box tinier. Okay, well, just pick on the top then. Pick on the top of the box. Right here? Yep. Yeah. And now pick on that big arrow. Yeah, and I move the mouse down. There. Well, a little too. So how big do you want it? Put um, that big. Yeah, and then I have to cut it that way. Okay. So just pick on the end. This one? No. The end of the shape. There you go. And now pick on that big arrow again. I just move it. Oh, see? It's doing it both at the same time. That's neat, eh? That way you don't have to tell it to do both sides at the same time. So is that about how big you want it? Maybe that, and now I have to cut this one. Okay. Right here? Yeah, you just move in the face. You don't actually have to cut anything. Yep, just pick it. Now pick the arrow that you want to move it in the direction. It's not doing both because we cut the two sides on equal. Can I move a shape? Can I yeah, move it? Yeah, you have it? to pick all the sides of it though. So hold the control down. Hold the control button down. Which one? On the keyboard. The, um, which Bottom one? left. It says control. The C T R L. Yep. Yeah. Hold that down. And it'll start picking the, the f parts of the shape Ball. that you want to move. Okay. So I have to move, so do I click this whole shape? Yep. Yeah. One, two, three. There. There's a little bit more. You gotta pick, just have to pick that one, yeah. And then you have to, then you have move to it. do this. You move the mouse over it, and you just wait, and then you right click. Hold on, we'll do this. Hold on. Okay, sorry. Now it's just picking faces, so all you gotta do is. We'll do this. There. So do I just move? Okay. So. So you're gonna shrink it? Like this? Yeah. Let's we'll do this. Yeah. Now I gotta shrink it this way. Okay. Then I might gotta shrink it that way. Now I need to put a line on it. Now I need to put two little circles down here. In, on the other side. Okay, well, use your circles. Sometimes. I always have to go to bed. Just pull the mouse. There you go. You just right click. There. You can draw your wheel. Okay, so we're doing good here. How is your I shape okay? Is everything the right size, you think? Yeah, but I need to do a wheel on the other side. Okay, so what you do is... F8. Pick, uh... Over here. Pick protrusion 4. This one? Yep. I'll go up to the top and look for something that says mirror. It's under the relate toolbar. Relate. Relate. Do you see something at the top that says relate? Right beside draw. Yeah. Okay, you see something that looks like uh, two things that are the same? Yep. Yeah. Symmetric. No, that's not what you want. I'm going to mirror the body. Sorry. Far to the right. You want to mirror it, right? Yeah. Look for the mirror command. What is it? What will it say? Say mirror. It's under the pattern toolbar. Under. Far right. There you go. Pick that. And now, 
the tricky part. What you want to do is you want to pick pick the plus sign under references. Okay, we'll pick the plus sign under reference planes. This one? No. Oh. That one. Okay, now this is where you're gonna place the mirror. So, what do you want to do? Round it. Okay. So click round? Yeah. Good guess. Put it here? Yeah. And then I click there? Yeah, and that's okay. So right click to stop it. Okay, now what else do you want to do? I want around this part. Okay. So pick it. Okay, is that the only side or do you want to do another one? Oh, um, then I'm going to do that okay. other side. Okay, we'll go pick it. There you go. So do I click right click just, now? Just hit escape and then you'll be done. There you oh, go. Perfect. Now I need to... Okay, so um, it's starting to come together. Um, if I told you that uh, James Dyson was going to be at this thing I'm going to next week, is there anything you'd like to say to him? Why is he going? Yeah. Just want to say hi to James Dyson. I'm your biggest fan, James Dyson. Dysons are my favorite vacuum in the world. Okay, and look what... Good job for making them. And look what he's yes. drawn. Okay, so we'll just stop here. No need to... Perfect.